Over the course of a hot day, the temperature rose by two and one fourth degrees every hour. At dawn, the temperature was 72 degrees. An expression giving the temperature t, the an expression giving the temperature t hours after dawn is two and one fourth t plus 72. What was the temperature after six hours? So essentially, they summarize this information in the first two sentences. The temperature rises by 2 and 1 fourth degrees every hour. That's this part of the statement right over here. At dawn, the temperature was 72 degrees, so you're starting at 72. So they're summarizing this equation right here. So when they say, what was the temperature after 6 hours, we really just have to substitute t equals 6 into this expression to get the temperature. So we just need to evaluate this expression at t is equal to 6. So it becomes 2 and 1 fourth, 2 and 1 fourth times 6 plus, plus 72. Now order of operations, you want to do multiplication before you do addition. So we have to want, we want to multiply the 2 and 1 fourth times the 6 first. And the easier way to do that is to turn this mixed number into an improper fraction. So this is a mixed number because it obviously has one part that's not a fraction, one part that is. A mixed not an improper fraction will have it'll be a fraction, but the numerator will be larger than the denominator. And to convert it, we take four times two and then add one. So four times two is eight plus one is nine. So this becomes nine over four times six. We can write six as six over one plus 72. And just to make sure you understand how this worked, 2 is the same thing as, let me write this over here, 2 and 1 fourth. This is equal to 2 plus 1 fourth, which is the same thing if you put a common denominator. What is 2? 2 is 8 over 4 plus 1 fourth. And so this is equal to 9 over 4. A quick way to do it is you realize that 2 is going to become 8 over 4, and you can think about that just by multiplying it by 4. 2 times 4 is 8, and then you're going to add it to this 1 over here to get 9 over 4. Once you get some practice, you'll just kind of do that in your head. And so this becomes, multiplying fractions is, is actually less painful than adding them. So we get, and we actually, even before we multiply this, we can reduce our answer a little bit. We can divide our eventual numerator and our eventual denominator by 2. So you divide the 6 by 2, you get a 3. Divide the 4 by 2, you get a 2. So it'll become 9 times 3, 9 times 3 over 2. So this is going to become 27, 27 over 2. That's this part right over here, plus, plus 72. Now we can convert this right here back into a mixed number. 2 goes into, let me do it over here on the side. So if you wanted to convert this into a mixed number, you take 2 into we take 2 into 27. 2 goes into, well, 2 goes into 2 one time. 1 times 2 is 2. You subtract, you get a 0, bring down the 7. 2 goes into 7 three times. 3 times 2 is 6. Subtract, we have a remainder 1. We could keep going and turn this into a decimal, but we just want to turn it into a mixed number. So this becomes, right over here, this part right over here is 13 with a remainder 1. So it's 13 and 1 half plus 72 plus 72, which is equal to, it's going to be something and a half. It's going to be 72 plus 13 and then another half. So let's see, 72 plus 3 would give us a 75. 72 plus 13 would give us to 85. So it's going to be 85 and a half. 85 and 1 half. And we are done. The temperature is 85 and a half or 85.5 if you used if you turn this into a decimal 85.5 degrees or 85 and a half degree after 6 hours